25. Sell at 25. No, no, no. Never called you that. No, but you're thinking about it. I'm telling you, relax. Dax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get in. Because it's a crime scene. It's all locked down. Eclipse marks some just a car. I don't know. Nobody is ever. Eclipse might be fun for you. For me, it's the future. Her first mate. Your father? He got her things when he traveled. It's not a competition, Dad. You don't even really remember him. And she found me after he died. Hey, I remember him, and I want to remember you. That's why I came on this trip. You're sure gateway weapons and armor are good enough for Eclipse? Yeah, I've got a friend in Eclipse. She told me what I needed to get. Passing firewalls. Maybe they're looking for X. I'm on a call. No, I haven't had any luck yet. She insists it was legal. Can I help you with something? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. Wait, why? Do you have a problem, or did she kill somebody already? Relax. I just need to speak with her. Good. Samara's the first Justicar I've seen on Ilium. If I'm lucky, things will stay peaceful. She went to the commercial spaceport a few hours ago. If you want to get there, the pedestal on that balcony will summon a cab. Just be polite when you meet her. Justicars embody our highest laws, and they usually stay in Asari space. She's not used to dealing with aliens. Is Samara really that dangerous? If you follow the laws, you've got nothing to fear. And a Justicar would die without hesitation to protect the innocent. But their code orders them to stop lawbreakers, with lethal force in most cases. And everyone skirts the law somehow on Ilium. If someone tried to bribe her, she'd be obliged to gun them down as a matter of honor. I'm hoping to avoid that. Why are you worried about other species coming into contact with her? If a Justicar kills an Asari, none of us questions it. But if she killed a human... Do you think the Alliance would understand her actions and respect her authority? You can't even figure out your own religions! It's a big, diplomatic incident just waiting to happen. Tell me about the Justicars. They're a monastic order. They've given up their families and possessions to follow their code. Most of them are on some lifelong mission, but they'll always stop to deal with any injustice they encounter, which can be a problem. In some ways, they're a lot like the Spectres, undertaking personal missions. Spectres are authorized by the Council. Who do Justicars represent? What? That's, like, I don't know a good human metaphor. They represent their code, our code. It's closer to a religious group than a legal branch. No law-abiding Asari would question a Justicar's orders. Nobody becomes a Justicar for personal gain. And they die before breaking their oaths. I'm looking for Samara. Like I said, she's at the commercial spaceport. You can hail a cab at the pedestal on that balcony over there.
Where do you think you're going? I'm taking my goods to Omega, Detective. You're not going anywhere, Merchant. Not until I solve this murder. I had nothing to do with that. It was those mercenary thugs you can't seem to get rid of. The victim was your business partner, and I'm not ruling you out. I'll let you know when you can leave. What about that Justicar that just showed up? Everyone says she might go crazy and start killing. I need to leave. She'll only kill the unjust, so I'm sure you have nothing to worry about, Pitney Four. Find me in the station if you need me. Nice guns. Try not to use them in my district. What can I do for you? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. If you've got a score to settle with Samara, take it somewhere else. I've got more than enough trouble here already. I need to recruit Samara for my mission. Then we'll be on our way. Justicars usually work alone, but they are drawn to impossible causes. She'll like our mission then. If you're getting her out of my district, I'll get you to her ASAP. She's at the crime scene. You're letting her into a sealed crime scene? I'm a cop. I'll work with the Justicar all I can. Besides, she's been looking at crime scenes longer than our two lifespans combined. She knows how to handle herself. You're awfully anxious to get Samara out of your district. My bosses want me to detain her. They're worried she'll cause some kind of cross-species incident. But her Justicar code won't let her be taken into custody. If I try it, she'll have to kill me. I have no interest in dying, so if you lure her away with some big noble cause before I have to carry out my orders, I'm thrilled to help you. Your superiors are sending you to certain death for no good reason. You have a right to disobey. Let's remember that next time Shepard sends us into impossible odds. That's about twice a day. Most of the time I'm not being stupid about it. I can't say the same for Anaya's superiors. I'm a cop and I know my duty. I've been ordered to detain her and I will. Unless I can get her to leave my district first. How do I get to the crime scene? It's around the corner. Go outside, take a left. Look for the police line. I'll send word to let you in. Be careful. The local Eclipse mercs have been all over those back alleys lately. What do I need to know about these mercenaries? Eclipse mercs are professional killers. They sell red sand, trade illegal weapons tech, and smuggle criminals off-world. They control some back alleys around here. I haven't been able to find their nest yet, though. What can you tell me about Justicars? They're a kind of... humans might call them warrior monks. They live by a complex code that compels them to punish the wicked and protect the pure. They've been a part of Asari culture for millennia. I read adventure stories about Justicars when I was a child. What do you think of Samara herself? She's been a Justicar longer than three of your lifespans. Whoever she was before she swore that oath, that person is dead. I have to go. Good luck. We should find Samara before the detective does. Anaya told us to let you through. Watch yourself. There's Merc activity back here. We're waiting on backup.
Those were my best troops. Tell me what I need to know, and I will be gone from here. Where did you send her? You think I'd betray her? She would hurt me in ways you can't imagine. The name of the ship. Your life hangs on the answer, Lieutenant. You can kill me, but one of us will take you down, Justicar! What was the name of the ship she left on? Go to hell! Find peace in the embrace of the Goddess. My name is Samara, a servant of the Justicar Code. My quarrel is with these Eclipse Sisters, but I see three well-armed people before me. Are we friend or foe? That Merc was wounded and helpless. Do you just kill anyone who won't help you? If my cause is important enough, yes. Are you different? I've killed enemies, but always with good reason. I answer to a code that is clearly defined. If my actions are true to that code, I am just. If they are not, I am unjust. I don't pretend it is a simple matter, or that it seems right to everyone. But I sleep well at night, and that is more than most can say. How may I be of service to you? I'm going up against suicidal odds, and I need the best. That's you. I sense the truth in what you say, and it humbles me. But I seek an incredibly dangerous fugitive. I cornered her here, but the Eclipse Sisters smuggled her off-world. I must find the name of the ship she left on before the trail goes cold. I wish you were willing to go with the human, Justicar. I've been ordered to take you into custody if you won't leave. You risk a great deal by following your orders, Detective. Fortunately, I will not have to resist. My code obligates me to cooperate with you for one day. After that, I must return to my investigation. I won't be able to release you that soon. You won't be able to stop me. There must be some way we can all get what we need. I see a way. While I am in custody, you find the name of that ship. Do that and I will join you. Then the code will be satisfied. Can you tell me more about Justicars? We are individuals who have forsworn family, children, and worldly possessions aside from some weapons and armor. We travel a sorry space righting wrongs as defined by the ancient code we have each memorized. A moment ago you refused to give up your investigation, but now you'll swear to follow me? If I stay, I will be compelled to kill many innocents to escape incarceration. Like me. I may be killed and my quarry would be free to continue murdering. If I come with you and survive your mission, I can resume my investigation. To do that, I need the ship's name to track her to her next hiding place. It is a simple choice. A slim chance is better than no chance. Do you have any leads? The Volus merchant Pitney Four is tied to this. Eclipse mercs are preparing to kill him. Get the truth out of him. He may know a way into the Eclipse base. Well... I've got to get back to my station, and I guess I've got to take you with me. Thank you, Shepard. If you're interested in weapons, I have a fine selection. Unfortunately, I am not open for business right now. I need information, and I hear you might have some insight. I have no idea who you are, Earth Clan. I hardly disclose private information to total strangers. The Eclipse are out for your blood. I need your help to break into their base. Shouldn't we work together? Yes. You're right, Earth Clan. I'm desperate. I've got angry mercs after me, and now this Asari Justicar. Let's talk. I smuggled a chemical onto Ilium that boosts biotic powers in combat. It also is toxic. I may have, um, forgotten to mention that to the Eclipse, so they are perturbed and want to kill me. 
It sounds like you're a swindler and your actions finally caught up with you. True and true. But I haven't survived as a merchant this long without being able to tell when there's a deal in the making. You want something. The Eclipse recently smuggled someone off-world. I need the name of the ship she left on. I don't know about their people smuggling operations. They must keep records in their base. I do have a pass card they issued me to bring my goods in. Well, I, I had to return that one, but I happened to make a copy. Take it, but be careful. Each Eclipse sister commits a murder to earn her uniform. They are all dangerous. I didn't fire my weapon once. I pretended to because the other Eclipse sisters were watching, but I didn't really shoot. You're in an enemy uniform and I'm gonna kill you. I'm not one of them. I knew. I thought being Elnora the mercenary would be cool, but I didn't know what they were really like. What do they do here that you don't like, Elnora? I thought we'd be flying around the galaxy shooting up bad guys and stuff, right? But no. They just sell red sand and illegal weapons tech. They even smuggled an Ardat Yakshi off-world. What does Ardat Yakshi mean? It's an ancient Asari word for something that... I thought was just a superstition until now. It means demon of the night winds. I didn't think they were real, but... The boss said this scary lady was one. What ship did they use for the smuggling? Wow, I have no idea. It was a few days ago, and like I said, I'm new. They didn't tell me anything. Get out of here, Elnora. If you so much as jaywalk, I will find you. Yes, ma'am. Okay, I'm going. Thank you.
have been spotted. seen us.
it's official. Little baby Elnora is finally a full-fledged Eclipse Merc. I earned my uniform last night when I killed that ridiculous Bolas. A close exploding rounds. Blew the little bastard's suit wide open. <laughs> I can't wait to see some real action. Next time I go home, my friends are gonna be so jealous. Elnora was the killer. If we'd known. We could tell the detective this. I am a biotic god. I think things, and they happen. Fear me, lesser creatures, for I am biotics made flesh. You need help. You need help? You stand before the mightiest biotic ever. Yes, the Asari injecting so many drugs into me was terrifying. But then I began to smell my greatness. They may laugh when I fall over, but they don't know what I know in my head. But I know that I am amazingly powerful. Fear me! Are you part of Pitney Force trade group? When I was mortal, I worked for Pitney. Poor soul is probably terrified that I have not returned. He didn't say anything about you going missing. He didn't want to get stuck here. I get the distinct impression Pitney prefers money to friends. Bah! I will wreak a just revenge upon his people. But first, the leader of these mercenaries is in the next room. I shall toss Wasaya about like a ragdoll. 
Fifteen creds says the little guy doesn't get five steps in before the merc explodes him. I will tear her apart. My biotics are unstoppable. Wasea will tear you apart. Take a nap. You'll feel better. Are you mad? I'm unstoppable. Feasting on her biotic rich blood will be the last... But... Great Wind... Biotic God... I'm... I... What was I saying? I'm... Tired... You... May be right... Yes... I'm tired... I'll nap... Destroy the universe later... He doesn't deserve to live. Everything's gone to hell since we smuggled that filthy creature off-world. First a Justicar shows up, now you. At least I can take pleasure in turning your head into a pulpy mass! I see you! This is probably the ship that Crazy Asari is looking for. Should we head back to the police station and give her the name? Or look around first? Let's give her the name and keep moving. Something that'll encourage the Justicar to leave, show it to her. I've got the name of the ship. Your fugitive left here two days ago on the AML Demeter. Shepard, you impress me. You fulfilled your part of the bargain, and I will fulfill mine. I am ready to leave immediately, if that will satisfy your superiors, Detective. You're free to go, Justicar. It has been an honor having you in my station. And it's nice you didn't kill me, too. The Eclipse smuggled an Ardat Yakshi off-world. She's who you're really after, isn't she? You continue to impress. Yes, I was here tracking the Ardat Yakshi. She is a dangerous criminal, and I will bring her to justice. After your mission is complete, of course. The Normandy is docked near the main trading floor. I'll see you aboard. I must be sworn to your service, so that I am never forced to choose between your orders and the Code. By the code, I will serve you, Shepard. Your choices are my choices. Your morals are my morals. Your wishes are my code. I never thought I'd see a Justicar swear an oath like that. If you make me do anything extremely dishonorable, I may need to kill you when I'm released from my oath. 
can see that this is a very important act, Samara. Thank you. Truly, the life of a Justicar can get lonely. I admit I am looking forward to serving with a company of honorable hero. Shall we return to your ship? Let's go. Welcome to the Normandy, Samara. We studied your profile extensively. With your skills, I think you'll be an excellent addition to our team. Thank you. From an organization such as yours, that is high praise indeed. I've seen Samara's biotic powers at work. They're substantial. We still don't know what we're going to find when we hit the Collectors. I will be prepared for whatever we encounter. Where shall we put you? A room that looks out on the great empty void would be most comforting. Put her in the observation room on deck three. Thank you. I must meditate on the day's events. Jack would like to talk with you, Commander. 